Right, not too much gaming news being announced today, but I did read something quite interesting here in the UK, um, and that is that the headline reads, Grand Theft Auto 5 aims to break UK sales record with huge allocation. Um, so basically, um, Rockstar are sending out 3 million copies uh, it says here, uh, UK retailers will reportedly be allocated with 3 million copies for the game's September release, which will be enough to smash the previous sales record set by Call of Duty Black Ops. Um, Black Ops received 1.4, um, <coughs> sold 1.4 million in its first day of release, and GTA 5 is being sent 3 million. Just be, just by pure demand and kind of the number of pre-orders that the game's received and everything, so it's looking like Grand Theft Auto V is going to smash the sales record for the UK. Um, I can't wait for the game. I haven't actually pre-ordered it yet myself. I need to do it really, um, really quite soon actually. If, judging by how popular it's going to be, I'm going to need to drop a pre-order soon. Hopefully, I'll um, get it a day before. And if I order from Shop2.net like usual, um, but. I can't wait for the game. It seems like it's going to be the final huge blowout for this current generation of gaming when we get it when we get GTA 5. I can't wait for it. I've really missed the good Rockstar games uh, game to play because obviously you know Rockstar games are huge. The scale of them are huge. So you dedicate a lot of your time to playing a Rockstar game. Um, and that's what I really can't wait to do. I can't wait to kind of bow out from this current generation by playing such a monster game that is Grand Theft Auto. Um, now, we all know that GTA 4 was, it was a decent game, but it doesn't, it doesn't really fit into the category of that legendary Grand Theft Auto game, in my opinion. Like I said, it was a good game, but the characters weren't kind of strong enough, in my opinion. The gameplay was very generic, there was no sort of fun GTA style aspect, and there wasn't much customization and kind of choices you could have in the game. But I know that in this one there's going to be a lot more customization, you can buy houses again, you can go where you want, you can fly planes, you can do all this crazy stuff that Grand Theft Auto is loved, about, loved for. So I do believe this is going to, as well as break all these records by selling the most games here in the UK, I really do think it's going to do well for the future of Grand Theft Auto because it's going to show that we love the, this style of Grand Theft Auto game um, a bit, a lot more. But there's not really too much to talk about. I just wanted to do a quick video kind of informing you guys about the kind of huge popularity um, of GTA 5, the amount of pre-orders there is. Um, for it and it looks like it's set to break all the UK records so um, that's about it for the video leave your thoughts down below on what you're looking forward to in GTA 5 I can't wait for the game definitely getting it day one so expect a lot of videos closer to the time as well um, so yeah that's about it for this video thank you for watching and I'll see you on my next one